peace, 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 fam. Peace, peace, peace. Today is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day. <sighs> I don't see why nobody didn't wake up feeling good this morning. <laughs> I know I feel great. Um, shit, just high off all these energies coming out. Y'all gotta stage the area. Gotta stage the area. But, um, just stage in the area, you know. <laughs> But um, today is a wonderful day. Oh my God, today feels good. I think I am uh, high off of the chaos. Um, cause you gotta, you know, you gotta transmute this this chaos energy into love. So I don't know what y'all doing. I don't know how y'all feeling sad. How y'all feeling like hurt? I don't know. But today is a good day. <laughs> today is a damn damn good day. Like y'all is tripping. <laughs> y'all isis love has left the building this is not isis love today because <laughs> i'm about to give it to y'all raw and hard and some of y'all not gonna enter and overstand it and some of y'all gonna be hurt by it be like uh-uh but it is okay because today is the day we lay it out family i don't even know where to start let's talk about this, this 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 energy coming in right now and how we're being distracted by this energy y'all man y'all got to get it together you know looking at my timeline this morning just lets me see what type of people is on my timeline and what kind of what kind of how people are not getting the picture some of y'all not getting it we have too many humans and, and not enough people that's tapped into self we got a lot of humans out there, a lot of emotions coming out. So let me go ahead and break it down for y'all, because I'm just, I'm hyped today. Like, I'm feeling good. Dang, I feel good. Hopefully some of this feel goodness will rub off on y'all. But, um, so, you know, November 11th, the 11-11 portal, you know, it marks uh the ninth year of completion. So from 2008, January 2008 to January 2017, that's nine years completed. That's the nine-year cycle. And um, also on November 11th, Neptune will be coming back into Pisces. It's coming back into its home planet. So basically what all of this stuff means is unconditional love is pouring down on us, you guys. It's going to be very active on the 11th, but this is the time where we have to really receive this unconditional love that's coming in. We're coming in a time of unity. We were in we were in separation for a while during those nine nine years. We were in separation. You know, we were it's just an, an illusion. Okay. Now we are coming into the fact that we need to come together. Only we can save ourselves. So all of this good energy is flowing it in and y'all being distracted about a damn election. <laughs> damn, y'all don't get it. Dang. I'm telling you, ISIS love has left the building. Like, y'all about to get this raw. <laughs> y'all got to wake up. Damn. Focusing too much on who won the damn election. It don't matter if Hillary would have won. It wouldn't have changed. The plan still would have been the same. It might not have went down the same, but the objective would have been the same thing. So stop worrying about who won the damn election. Because you're going to save yourself. This is the time to unite. So this energy, the 11-11, when you think about one plus one, that's two. Duality. Becoming in balance with our masculine and our feminine self with our left and our right hemisphere, with our dark and our light side, embracing the dark order out of chaos. Y'all don't see the signs and the symbols? Shake that shit off and wake up. Hey, oh my God. I don't know if it's just because I'm a, I mean, like, I feel like all my emotions is just, they're simply just fading away. And I really think that it just has to do with just being in the now, being in the moment, and being in the in the knowing, not letting them emotions take over you. Stop just focusing on the bad and thinking about all the people that's about to die and all the bad stuff that's about to happen. What about the good stuff that's about to happen? 
Huh? What about the good stuff was about to happen? Y'all so stuck in fear. Wake the fuck up. Let me try to bring this back. And if y'all offended by my language, y'all already know where y'all need to go. Because I'm tapping into that dark energy and I'm giving it to y'all raw. So, um, just all over. So, so, you know, two, being in balance, being in balance with yourself. Right now is the time for that shadow work. That's why that Kali energy has been in effect. When that, when you embrace that Kali energy, that, that you you embrace the shadow work. You deep, you dig deep into yourself and you pull that stuff out. We all going through it right now. Kali, all on my damn timeline. Oh y'all, all of it. The nurturing, the mother, the all. We are all tapping into these energies. So bring these energies out. Bring all of this shit out that y'all don't need, y'all. We about to really escalate to the next level. And I can see a lot of y'all is not ready because y'all still in y'all human emotions and trying to mask it with other stuff. It ain't got nothing to do about being a humanitarian and all of this. You could be all of this. But don't let your emotions run you. Know that every choice is divine that is made. Know that there is no mistakes, no evil. Just flow. A lot of y'all not ready. That's why we had to have Trump. Because y'all still not ready. Y'all still going to be sh- shooken up a little bit. Order out of chaos. So, embracing this Kali energy. Embracing this dark energy. Y'all so afraid of the dark. I love the dark. I'm a dark worker. Because I awaken the dark and bring them to the light. So, embrace your dark side. Do your shadow work. Bring out who you got to bring out. If you ain't familiar with Kali, go look it up. Because there's a lot of misconceptions. And if you ain't in your heart, and if you ain't really broke a lot of barriers, you're going to see Kali as being something evil because you don't enter and overstand a lot. You don't see the meaning behind the meaning. You got to see the meaning behind the meaning. Open up your freaking first eye. Open it up. The information is there. So... Tapping into this Kali energy and bringing out all of that dark shadow stuff that you need to bring out. Some of your stuff you need to embrace and love. Bring out that damn sexual energy. Bring out that kundalini. We have to stop repressing our sexual energy. Even me, I'm guilty of it. I'm saying it because I ex- I am experiencing it myself. So I know if I'm experiencing it, y'all experience it. So let out that kundalini energy. That sexual repression, all these damn moral codes and, oh, I can't do that because you're like that. Or, um, I'm trying to be celibate, so I, I, I can't have sex with you. You're missing out on experiences. Of course, don't be all out there hoeing around or whatever type of label y'all want to put on it. And just sleeping around, just inviting anything into you. But there's certain type of energies you need to experience. This kundalini energy has to rise and know it's not all about sex. But sex is a creative energy, and we are holding it in. That's another thing that um, Kali represents, that Lilith, that bottom. Kali is that root. Kali has to meet Shiva. Kali is also uh, uh, another name for Shanti. Shanti coming up, rising, coming into that lotus, and blossoming into Shiva. Woo! It's coming in. Damn, it's coming in. It's coming in. Oh my gosh, I gotta wake up. Man, I gotta wake up. There's so much love coming in right now. There's so much love coming in. And y'all missing out on this love. Y'all missing out on this love because y'all are so conflicted. Man, I don't know how y'all gonna, I don't know how y'all gonna understand this. Damn. This love coming in so strong right now. Y'all got to feel this. Y'all got to feel this love. Whoa. So embrace this Kali energy. Do your freaking shadow work. Release what you got to release. Okay? So not only is it time for shadow work, it's time to embrace the love and the judgment. Judgment free. It's time to embrace the inner child. 
it's okay to experience the emotions. Experience the emotions. But don't let the motherfucking emotions take over you. You the master of your vessel. Stop letting, you know what they do? They feeding on y'all fear. Nom, 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 nom. Just eating on y'all fear right now. Eating on y'all fear. Because y'all so fearful right now. Because y'all think just because y'all were to choose Hillary, everything would have been different. I love that Trump is. I'm team Trump. Team motherfucking Trump. Because we need that to come together. Don't y'all see the bigger picture? Y'all see the bigger picture? <laughs> y'all don't see the bigger picture. Y'all definitely don't see the bigger picture. Because half of y'all on my Facebook page and y'all emotions. So y'all ain't seeing it. We have to come together now. White, black, Puerto Rican, Latino, half black, half white, half Puerto Rican, half Latino, whatever the fuck you claim, we need to come together now to be able to save ourselves, okay? We got to look past the Hebrew Israelite fighting with the, with the Hebrews. That shit's childish. Get out your fucking ego. A whole bunch of men being patriarchal. Come to a damn agreement. Got time to be fighting between those goddamn he- Hebrew Israelites and the fucking Hebrews and the damn Christians and the Muslims. Wake the fuck up. We're in a new damn paradigm. Damn. We're in a new paradigm. Wake up. They ain't getting this nowhere. Y'all sitting there fighting, having damn debates. They ain't getting nowhere. Wake up. We need to come together in oneness. Y'all want to see change? Y'all want to see people get off the streets, being homeless and stuff like that? Do your self-work. Work on yourself. Hey. Woo. Woo. I'm sorry. I'm coming at y'all raw today. Ain't no butterflies and no, no, no flowers with me today. Y'all need to wake up. It, 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 you know what? It's seriously the five percenters. It might even be the one percenters. Because it's not a lot of people that's truly awoken right now. Another thing is, okay, I understand we got empath, empaths out there. People that feel other people's emotions. When I was in my emotions, I felt other people's emotions a lot. But the more that I see that everything is divine, I don't let my emotions control me. Empaths, you have to get grounded. You have to protect yourself. You have to enter and understand what's going on so you won't let your energy go off to that. Okay? So we can't use as an excuse, I'm an empath. I just use this. Who I understand everybody's waking up to their powers and waking up to their ability. They're trying to, you guys are trying to learn how to control this. But come on now, the time is now. Don't miss out on this energy that's coming in right now. Get ready on a November the 11th. You need to really open up your heart. You need to let go of that damn baggage. Because when this super full moon come in, the super full, full moon come in on the 14th, this super full moon is going to be as big as in 70 years and ain't never been so big. That means that moon is damn near going to be touching our heads. If you don't take and embrace this freaking energy that's about to come in right now, you better take this energy that's coming in right now stop being all fucking sad because a lot of people going to die. Don't you know that these people sign up to die on this day and that day? We choose to die when we want to die. We already chose that. So you getting all mad and stuff because people are about to die? Yes, people are about to die. Die, don't even see death is death. It's a rebirth. When we go to sleep at night, we die. When we wake up, we up. The sun and the moon die every day. You eat food, you shit it out, it helps stuff grow. And everything is death and rebirth. Get out of that. If a homeless person is on the street, don't you think that this is their journey and their path to be homeless? You feeling all sorry and shit, messing up your damn day because you sad because some person's homeless. Don't you think that they chose to be homeless that day and you all sad and shit coming out your element because you sad? Oh, my God. Y'all got old, oh, man, man, man. Woo! Some of y'all just need to see it, but it's all good. We gonna we gonna see it. That's the good thing. I had to get off on y'all like that. 
and then here come that Oya, here come that that mother inside, here come Isis. <laughs> We're gonna get it, okay, y'all. It's gonna be some pain. Hold up, y'all. I got, I got. It's gonna be some pain. There's gonna be some bloodshed. There's gonna be some heartbreak, family. But fear not. All is divine. And all shall pass. You may not see it this lifetime, but it shall come to pass, y'all. We got to come together. Ooh, we got to come together. It don't matter if she gay and he gay and he fucking him in the ass and she eating her damn coochie. Who the fuck cares? That's them. Don't dislike them and miss out on love because they doing what they want to do. Don't be getting mad at them just because they pray to some god named Allah. Get it the fuck together. We got to come together. It don't matter what president is in the damn office. Chaboom chabagaye. Some black man or some white man. It don't matter. Okay? It don't matter. The choice is yours. The power is in the people. So wake up. Took me a lot of energy to come out here with these messages. So y'all better freaking take heed of what I'm saying right now. This ain't no game. Wake up and create your reality. You woke up sad and damn depressed because Trump won. That's up to you. I woke up like this. Happy than a motherfucker. Transmuting that damn nigga. I'm, you know what? I'm just high off this damn chaos. I love it. Because you know what? I'm transmuting it. And I know that it's something good is going to come out of it. So I'm not even letting it affect me. I'm letting it affect me in a way as I'm transmuting the energy and I'm taking it for positive energy because I feel fucking bubbly. <laughs> I feel damn good. I feel strong. I feel powerful. I know I create my reality. I know y'all create y'all reality. I know together we can be so strong. We can be powerful together. Don't y'all understand that we create our reality? We can do this together and we shall. So I'm gonna need some of y'all to wake the fuck up. Yo, y'all play a good, y'all post shit online all day long. God is this, me, uh, yoga, meditation, I'm juicy for five days. And okay, cool. But do you really fucking enter and understand what the hell is going on? Juicing and shit and damn yoga and kumbaya. And do you fucking still understand what's going on? Because I don't think some of y'all get it. Y'all think just because y'all wear hair wraps, y'all do yoga every morning. I mean, damn, I mean, I don't get everything, but shit, I can see this. <laughs> I damn can see what's, shit, what's going on. I love y'all. I can't even waste no more energy on it. I won't even say waste any more energy, but I don't want to give no more energy into it. Um, Work on the root chakra. Work on feeling secure because you are secure. You are balanced. Um, you're stable. You're all. So really, y'all, November 11th come. Really sit down. If you want, join together as a group and do it because it's even stronger. Come, come together as a group and meditate on an intention or whatever. Whatever you want to do. And we have power. Okay, y'all? Please get out your feelings. Get out your feelings. Please take your energy. Because when y'all indulge in this energy, we all together. I need y'all to get online, to get synced in, so y'all can pull from the source energy, so y'all can be a channeler and channel it and lead it and do, and do all this type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not hard. It's really not hard. So do your root chakra work, do your channeling, your shadow work, embrace this energy, do your own research on the 11-11 portal. Do your own research on November the 14th. Don't just take what I say. No matter what president won, 
shit still going. You don't see the birds and shit, man. You don't see the damn uh lizards and the butterflies and stuff marching and going on strike. They flowing. They know what's up. So get in tune. Sync up. Elevate. Activate them DNAs. Come on. Yes. Girl, I had to smoke on this. These are just a little special herb blend I got right now. It's just a special herb blend, you know. But, um, yeah, besides the point, y'all, just, just wake up. All right, I'm done. I can talk for hours. Share this video. Please share this video. Share it, share it, share it. There's so many zombies out there that need to wake up. I love y'all. My mama's birthday today. Today's the ninth day. Complete year. My mom's in the cycle. We're about to celebrate. I love you. Oh, and if you want your readings, you better get your readings in today. Because tomorrow, it's going to be real tight for you. I might only take one or two readings tomorrow. So if you need some confirmation on what you need to get rid of to be able to harness in this damn energy right now, see what y'all got to do, okay? One love, family.